Hello and welcome to this Power BI tutorial. We are continuing our tutorial series and in today's tutorial we are going to discuss two more functions and those are power product and product X. Okay, so let's start. So before we start, let's look at one table. We I have this table cat which has category as numbers 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and I'm going to use it here and basically what product is going to do is each row numbers is going to multiply. So let's create a major first of all and we are going to call this major as product itself. So PRO product and let's take product and let's take category and category and category. that's the number if we give something else it will add it out let's take a card and on the card let's put product so it should be 720 because uh, if you multiply the first six number that's going to give us 720 now what's the difference product x going to bring to us so we can actually create a new major let's copy this major first of all and with the help of this major only we are going to create a new one so first of all same as product let's try the same version as product no difference so x and then it needs a table first of all so we can use category comma this one and same formula category or category and let's put a card visual and let's put our major there the product x major and let's see what happens so product x same results uh, plain format it's a row level stuff we are doing now but what we can do here is we can multiply it by two or divide by two we can have expression we can multiply two numbers basically and can get other number or maybe we do divide it by two so let's say we divide it by two okay so we can get another number like this or maybe we can put certain conditions so let's go ahead and put certain conditions out here because we have product x and here we can have its own filter so let's try and write down filter and in the filter we'll say okay we have something known as group one there and in the group one we would like to have value also as group one so group one has three values one five one three and five and let's close this filter and okay so it's going to give us 15 one three and five is 15 now i can multiply it by two so it's going to multiply each each row row level it's happening so two 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 in three rows which is eight and 15 multiply eight is 120 so this is how you are going to use it now you can have product of two numbers or you can have sum of two numbers and then product of those two numbers So product x you can actually write an expression so you can do that so sum two numbers and then do the product of the entire set and all those you can give filters you can try some more combinations in there so go ahead and try these out do let us know what else you wanted to cover us in power bi functions uh, subscribe to our channel press the bell icon so that you can get notification for our new video thanks for watching this video thank you